Okay, this has been an adventure this year. Had problems with uh, soybeans and weeds and doesn't look like much. Plenty of uh, lambs quartered and escaped. We couldn't get into a timely manner. Those are gonna get up. That poor stand, um, uneven emergence of the soybeans. I think it's due to compaction. They're planted at the right depth. There's, it's really uneven. So I'm, I'm walking across south of the creek here because I've got a little something to show you over here. And I just wanted to check where that was. As I crossed this creek to come over here to cultivate this, I noticed my implement was hitting the ground. Now this should be soybeans over here. You kind of see this? Okay, so there's a row right there. And then 30 inches over, there should be a row. There should be a plant every inch and a half. And obviously, there's not. So they're down there. They just didn't come up. They ran out of energy below the surface. And it's really hit or miss. There isn't any um, rhyme or reason to the pattern back of that tractor. Didn't notice anything funny about that. And like over here, you kind of see this row. You know, lamb's quarter, lamb's quarter. No soybeans. There's a soybean. There's another soybean. Like I said, it should be every inch and a half. And you go up there and there's a few, but it's just pathetic. And the end rows in particular are bad. Well, that tractor's leaning. That was the problem. So I dropped the implement off of it. Got a flat tire. I came out here. I think I can get. I don't even know if it's worth me trying to jack this up or I'm just going to call them on uh, Nobles. Because for me to get under my jack under there. doing anything. That tire's buggered no matter what. It's gonna end today's uh, Sunday. Tomorrow's the 4th of July. Maybe on Tuesday they can come out here. So I, I was gonna row cultivate this, but I just tine weeded it. And um, I am not optimistic about this field. You know, there's just rows where I'm like, there's nothing. You know, there's one there. And then you go foot, there's another plant there. They'll recover when they're beat up like that, but there should be one every inch and a half. And. There's 40 acres here. Now there should be a row of soybeans right, right there. There's nothing. It's just pathetic. And the advice I got was that, well, if you can break up, and there's no crusting, there's no, uh, I don't know, I'm kind of at a loss. What, you know, I think this field is, something might come back, but I don't know if it'll be worth anything to, uh, to harvest. This is planted a day after north of the creek. And north of the creek, I don't have anything like this. Same planter, same condition, I just flipped over. I mean... It's like a joke. I don't know what, I don't know what happened.
I really don't. So, anyway, the video is getting kind of long, but I started time weeding this late last night. I hooked up the uh, time weeder to the 7220 after that tractor went down. Got it done this morning. It's supposed to rain this afternoon. Rain all day tomorrow. Thankfully, we got most of the stuff done. Hopefully, they can come out here and get the tire fixed on Tuesday or Wednesday, and then we'll continue on with this. Um, well, I'm glad I walked out here and didn't lug the jack out. I'm not going to jack that tractor out. Home sweet home.